Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you and explain to you how you can convert a SharePoint page to a SharePoint news post and vice versa. Uh, let me explain to you what I'm talking about. So sometimes there are situations when you, uh, let's say, add a new page, add some text to it, and then realize that maybe it should have been a news post. Now, a news post is pretty much a page as well. It's a SharePoint page behind the scenes, but it uh, has some special um, you, you know, characteristics because it does show that page uh, and the news web part. Um, so obviously, if you created a regular page, it's not going to show um, in the news web part. It has to be a news post. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, let me show you how you can convert a page to a news post now. Let's go ahead and create a new page first. Here we go. Uh, let's start with blank. Uh, and I'm going to give it a, a name. Here we go. Perfect. Maybe some text here. All right. About the event. Um, here we go. Publish. Obviously, I published the page. Uh, now, the page itself um, is uh, resides in the site pages library. Uh, I will go there in a second. But if you notice, it doesn't show up over here, right? Because it's just a regular page. It's not a new post. So let's check where it is. Uh, and it is over here in the site pages library. That's where all the pages reside. It doesn't matter whether they're regular pages or news posts. They're all here. And look at this. Here is my uh, page I just added. How do we convert this page to a news post? Let me show you a trick. Let's click. You click promote. And look at this. It says post as news on the site. All you need to do is just click on it. And let's see what happens. Look at this. Here is my news post right now. It pretty much converted the page into the news post. Now, behind the scenes, really nothing happened. All right. Nothing happened behind the scenes. It's still in the site pages library. It just uh, is just, um, you know, uh, pretty much converted behind the scenes a, a page to a news post. So it's displayed in the news web part. Now, how do we go? How do we re reverse that? Let's just say it's the other way around. You created a, a news post and then realized, you know what? It's really just a regular page. We don't need it. Uh, we don't need uh, uh, it uh, to be shown in the news web part. Let me show you the trick for that. Uh, a few more steps involved. So uh, what we need to do first, let's just create uh, a news post. Here we go. Some uh, news post. Here we go. All right. Uh, some news here. Perfect. We post the news. All right. Now, obviously, the, the news will show up in the news uh, web part um, just because it's a news post. Uh, I don't want that. Now I want to go back. I want to convert this to a regular page. How do we make it happen? Hit promote. And all you need to do is just click save as page template. Here we go. And it saves it as a template uh, on your site. So let's do that. Yeah, I guess I have to give it a name. So um, I mean, some new post. It doesn't, doesn't really matter um, You know what we name it. Here we go. Perfect. And now what it did, let me just actually show you what it did behind the scenes. In the site pages library, uh, it actually created this folder. That's where our template resides. Uh, now, here is a trick. Here is a trick. Now, when you uh, create a new page, all you need to do is just pick on that template. All right. So we we there are a couple of more steps involved, right? Um, you know, we converted the news post, we made it a template, and then when we create a new page, we're going to pick from that template. So let me show you how to do that. Here we go. Add a new page, and look at this. Here is our template that we just saved. And it's going to create a page, and it's carrying over the, you know, uh, carrying over the information, right? Obviously, you have to supply the title, um, our new page here, perfect. And then it will carry over all the text, all the, you know, styling and, you know, layouts and columns and everything you had, all the web parts in here. Uh, if you notice, right, it retains the text. So all you need to do is just hit publish. That's all, all right? That's all. We now pretty much saved a lot of time now uh we still have this news post i mean which we can probably delete right we pretty much just copied the information over all right without copying the information over right we use this uh, template trick uh so you really didn't need to do copy and paste and all that stuff 
Um, so now maybe it's a good time for us to go ahead and clean up and uh, delete the, that um, you know news post we created in the first place. Here we go. And uh, our page is still here, all right, with all the text and everything. And pretty much now, this is a page that uh, has been converted, if you will, from the news post. All right, um, so that's all uh, I wanted to show you today. Um, hopefully you learned a nice trick today. Uh, as always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.